Meow. Meow. Hi, it's Penny Bowden, crazy cat artist. This is a, I guess what they call a doll face Persian, the traditional Persians. I just thought it would be fun to do. So I'm just mapping in the kitty shapes. And really it's the shape of the fluff more than anything. I'm going four times the speed and voicing over. Get some spots for the eyes in there. I might have that mouth and nose a little squished up. I'll have to fix that up. little paws peeking out from underneath. I love to hear from you, so please drop me a comment. Tell me about your cat or yourself or whatever. Your art. Tell me what country you live in or whatever you want to talk about. What you want to learn about cat drawing. Yeah, wasn't too happy with that. Had to muck with it. A little better now. A little bit more of a squished up face than the kitty in the picture has. But that's okay. I just kind of like to let my cats become what they become. As long as they look comfortable and they have a certain charm about them, that's what makes me happy. And if they don't, well, then they were good practice and I'll move on to the next and take what I learned with me. Those tabby markings on the forehead are always great for adding expression. We'll just darken up the lines now. Help things pop a bit. Just the lines that really define Kitty. All those other excess lines can just fade away into background tone. Nope, gotta fix it again. Got to get those tufts of hair in the ears right so they look convincing. And don't forget to use your eraser as a tool just as much as your pencil. I don't like to think of a eraser as a way of fixing mistakes. I like to think of it as a drawing tool because that's what it is. Yeah, let's fix that ear up. I like that better. Little smirk. Thank you so much for watching today. There's lots more videos to come, so we'll see you next time.